Okay, um, I'm making this video, a short video about the police brutality in the Netherlands. You see, in previous years there was police brutality, but most people didn't pay attention to it in the Netherlands. Since, uh, since around 2008, I believe, the general population began to spend more time watching the police, what the police was, was doing. And also many incidents of brutal force were reported. I'm not talking about when an armed criminal tries to kill a police officer and they use force to, pre to take in the, the, the suspect. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about, for example, pointing a gun to an 11 year old boy who posed no threat whatsoever or you jump five police officers upon a man, choke him and he dies. And later you lie that he had an illness. See, such stuff. Or, I've, I've witnessed this, we had this racist police officer, he, he saw this Chinese, a Chinese friend was with me and he began to intimidate, intimidate the Chinese guy that was standing there with me. But he didn't say anything to me, you see. I'm not sure if I told this before, but that race police officer, he got out of the car, he walked past me and began to harass that Chinese guy and forced him to cooperate because, he's, because of a law that he didn't break. With me, he didn't do anything. I even asked him what was going on, he just replied politely. You see, listen, a few years back, I asked urgently for us for supernatural protection from the Most High because I knew that if those people go too far with me, I might do things I don't want to do. It's not just just child molesters that can get me in trouble. Such people also. The Most High has placed a, a supernatural protection of fire around me that will keep such insane psychopathic police officers at a distance. Not everyone has that. Because think about it. If I didn't have that protection, they would have harassed me or even killed me. Especially because I'm a Christian and I'm serving the Lord. And I'm black. And a racist antichrist country. The Lord placed me here so I held God accountable for my safety. You should do the same. And there's another thing I just want to make clear here. If you are a tourist and you're in the Netherlands, and if you're a Christian, pray, seriously. If you have people with you who aren't safe, pray for their safety. Seriously, because the veil is being lifted. Previous years, before 2008, most of the crimes of the police corps were just ignored. People pretend they didn't exist. But the more people began to use social media and YouTube, the more things be uh, were revealed and the tensions are quite high here. So pray for your safety because you can't trust police officers around here. I'm not saying all police officers are bad guys, but for the general you can't trust them. I certainly don't trust them at all. I made it plain on, in previous videos, I don't trust them. Okay? Anyway, just watch out and don't talk to police officers if you don't need to talk to them. Avoid them as much as possible. And it's not only for the Netherlands, it's for everywhere, but police brutality is increasing. Okay, that being said, y'all, enjoy your day and be blessed.